Hello everyone. Welcome here. In this lecture, we are going to learn switch case statement. How simply we are going to preparing these switch cases? You are going to know in JavaScript. See, switch case is in a specifically specifically designed to run a block of code which code block to be execute you will define a particular value or expression based on that input user inputs straight away switches the expression and uh, it, the particular block of code only will execute it won't verify like uh, such as statements uh, which we have written like uh, if else these things not at all so we'll see how these things are possible to verify one by one like a six expressions will be evaluated once only based on the expression evaluation it will runs the value of expression to be each case you have to specify if none of the case is matching based on the input of user expression it will be goes there in default so each case is going to be have a once the code is executed it will be break and it will terminates the uh, execution from the switch case and it will go out okay in this way we'll see about the switch case code like a uh, code blocks in javascript we'll write let del take it okay it's a variable i'm defining a simple uh, variable and writing the switch statement a keyword swit switch switch is in a reserved keyword inside the switch i am writing like uh, getting something an hour uh, anything you may take maybe uh, like a uh, hour uh, you may write like uh, here also you can take a uh, hour let uh, h o u r hour equal to new like a uh, getting date date method by pressing dot get day get hour or get day whatever it you want you can take it so hours i have taken um, day already which is assigned no so how we will go now any anything we may use it um, days of the week like uh, day shall i take or what it um, yes let's 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 uh, switching the direct uh, how what's the day it is uh, taken later we'll try to make the modifications of it okay let's switch here it is a statement it is now open and end parenthesis you need to write inside the switch cases you have to implement the case statements okay now case statements is like um, case we need to write and uh, something like a zero colon write enter and colon it is not terminator it's a colon and uh, day one variable we have a declared above no so the day it would be sunday terminate and break it terminate this is the case one now the case two case one 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 to be right so the day something same would be repeated like uh, same would be repeated in this way we if we've written the same thing same case i am taking a copy and paste over here i'm changing the name to case one so it is monday save it okay monday tuesday wednesday thursday the same way like uh, we'll take a copy of these cases so one case is over put enter paste paste okay enough to write i think so it's a two it's a three so monday after monday it's a tuesday t u u s tuesday t h u r s thursday so three cases zero one two three four cases i have written here okay now but like uh, if we want to see what is the day today if i want to see the what is the day today how i can implement this how i can implement this let's see this is also very simply uh, we can get it like uh, after the day break it is there given 
this day I'm going to print in our here I'll print it uh, like let's see simple statement I'll write today is with this uh, I can concatenate with the this variable that's it this variable I'm concatenating so let's see first save it and run it first wow today is Thursday it is coming so according to the date it is today it is coming something like a, it's a date get day so today it is a coming like a 3 I think the case is printing like a 3 we are getting so based on that it's giving an output of a, uh, output of case 3 0 if it is added no so the Monday if it is taken it will be according to you have to change it as uh, how the system is uh, taking from your uh, sys computer system according to you need to choose the code and uh, uh, which block is going to be assigning and how it is running you have to define it okay so now to extending this one how the break is working how the like a default is working we have to extend it like let let let's check it let's simply we can test it after the break the cases i'm going to add in one more is d f a u l t default with the default what happens like a day um, with the default day equal to oh, double quotes yeah mm. just information purpose i'm giving like a great day okay default it's in a great day i'm defining if nothing is coming to switching the expression over here nothing is coming so by defaultly switch case will going to enter into this particular area okay so why this is a very important switch cases why these are the very very important there the sp spaces may require may not require up to your wish okay so why it is important means if you want to make a like a functionality which is a functionality is a commonly available in your system and you need to use very quickly without making any specification of condition directly you, you have in a provision to switching the code one place to another place such time you may implement switch cases very greatly all right so it will be very helpful for you to run with this default and break keywords it's a fully qualified javascript switch case statements all right so this you know i think this is the element is going to be assigning to this uh, paragraph and hence we are getting an output over here if you give in a space you will get it all right just check it and let's uh, test yourself and uh, you will get accurately the output Let's check if I am removing this information, this information if I am removing, save it, reload, nothing is coming. If I given directly like uh, some zero, let's check what happens, reload, it's a Sunday is coming. If I am giving directly like a something switch like a two manually, hmm? save it and reload, Tuesday it's coming. So based on your system, oh sorry, sorry, sorry. Based on your system date time things, it will be accept your inputs. I hope it's very simple lecture. Try to practice more examples with the real world data. Catch you in the next lecture. Thank you.